tutorial on how to play Drunkard's Prayer by Chris Stapleton. We're in standard tuning, there's no capo. In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you the verse, the chorus, and the pre-chorus. We only have three chords. We have an E, an A, and a B major chord. That B major chord is the only bar chord if you're a beginner. Um, I'll teach you a way you can play that a little easier if you are a beginner. Um, but it's a good song to jump into if you're a beginner and you're trying to learn bar chords. So, we're going to start out here with the verse. E chord. So your E, you're going to have your index finger on the first uh, fret of the G string, middle fingers on the second fret of the A, ring fingers on the second fret of the D. We're going to pick our root note, E, strum down, up. When we strum on the second time, we're going to raise our middle finger, and we're going to hammer onto that second fret. So that part sounds like this. down, up, strum after you do your hammer on. So it goes like this. That's on your E chord. From there we're going to go to our B major chord. So you're barring the 2nd fret with your index finger from the 5th string down. Your ring finger is going to bar the 4th fret, the D, G, and the B string. And you're going to try and mute that high E, or you can just play an A chord on the 4th fret. And just play those three strings. And if you can, you can slide your index finger on that root note as well. But if you're a beginner and you can't slide that there, just play that A chord on the 4th fret. Which means all those fingers are sandwiched in on the 4th fret, the D, G, and the B strings. Okay, so you're going to stay on this B chord, you're going to pluck your root note, A string, B note, and we're going to go, uh, we're going to pluck, strum down, up, pluck, strum down, up, and then we're going to go back to our E. To our B major. progression three times and you go to your B major and back to your E. And that is the verse. So to transition into the pre-chorus we go like this on our E chord after we do this once we're gonna go then we're gonna lift our middle finger up to the second fret of the low E, pinky to the fourth of the low E, and then we're going to play an open A note and transition to our A chord where we have our middle finger on the 2nd fret of the D, ring finger on the 2nd fret of the G, and our pinky on the 2nd fret of the B string. And we're going to do this pattern four times. So we're going to strum our A string down, up, pluck the A string down, up, three, four, go to our E chord for two. to the A chord for two, back to your E chord for two, then we're going to go to our B major chord, A chord for two, to your E chord, back into the verse. So that's the verse in the pre-chorus. Uh, the chorus itself, we're going to start out on our B major chord. And we're going to go for four strums. So pick, down, up, pick, down, up, pick, down, up, pick, down, up. To your A chord for two. E chord for two. 
this is the chorus, so pick down up, pick down up, B chord, A for two, E for two, B, A, E. And that's it, so that's the chorus. I taught you the pre-chorus and the verse as well, and those are the three main segments that are played throughout the entire song. So I went through that all pretty quickly. If you have questions, go ahead and comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.